When measuring knee flexion strength, you may want to bias either the medial or lateral hamstrings. So let's say, for example, you're suspicious of pes anserine, tendonitis, or bursitis. You may want to bias semitendinosus and gracilis. And the way we can do that is your hamstrings are not only knee flexors, but they also play a role in tibial rotation. So those medial hamstring muscles also internally rotate the tibia. So a slight modification of technique to bias the medial hamstrings would be we can flex the knee, also slightly internally rotate the tibia. I'll use the, when applying force with my left hand, I'll use the foot as a lever to create rotation. So as I'm pulling the knee into extension, I'm also rotating the tibia into external rotation. All right, so again, the table is creating our fulcrum or stabilization counterforce. The knee is close to mid range of motion. You're gonna hold it right there. Ready? Hold, hold, hold. So again, my direction of force is extension and lateral rotation of the tibia. I can also bias biceps femoris. Same idea. Biceps femoris is a flexor and it's also an external rotator, or lateral rotator of the tibia. So I can change my hand position here. I will again use the foot to create a lever to rotate, to rotate the tibia into internal rotation. So you're gonna hold it right there. Don't let me move you. Hold, as I try and break her hold, I'm pulling into extension and medial rotation. Hold, hold, hold. 